Baking Science Lab of 2021. Katie and David will do an egg in the bottle experiment. You can watch an egg magically fit inside a bottle while learning about air pressure. Katie Blake and David Sears join us in the studio this morning. Hey guys. Good morning. And good morning. Katie Blake, there's something different about you. Ah, uh, is there? Yeah. <laughs> Congratulations on being a newlywed. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Welcome back. Thank hope you. you. Had a great honeymoon and yes. we hope you guys have many, many happy years together. Well, thank you very much. And I do want to give a shout out to my husband. I'm still getting used oh. to saying that uh, because <laughs> as I was prepping for this last night, I realized I needed a different kind of glass bottle and uh -huh. he ran with me down to the corner store to get these little right. uh, iced cappuccino bottles. So thank you. Darling. Well done. Mark? Yes. Not this Mark. <laughs> other Mark. Here's another, another Mark. mark. Yeah. <laughs> All right. You ready, David? I'm ready. Let's let's, let's kick off let's 2021. Fire this, up. this is the egg in a bottle experiment. Yes, we are going to make a hard boiled egg fit inside of a bottle. So you will need hard boiled eggs. You'll need some kind of glass bottle. I think your best bet is to go get one of those like iced cappuccinos from the corner store or even the grocery store uh, because otherwise it's kind of hard to find glass bottles these days. You'll need some paper and matches or a lighter. So f open flame is involved here. So parental supervision is required. On the part. Okay. Got that, David? I got okay. it. Parental supervision. So this is all about air pressure, and we'll talk about that in okay. a few minutes, but I want to get a setup first. So I'm here's ready. your lighter. Ooh. Here's mine. Ooh. We've got our eggs here. So what we're going to do. So my question, first question is, what came first, the chicken or the egg? <laughs> That's beyond my pay grade. You guys didn't know. study that at Texas Tech? We probably we had a lot of chickens at Texas Tech. <laughs> I was going to say. We had a lot of eggs. I was going to say. Whole, like, you know, <laughs> so, okay, here's what we're going to do. So do so, I need to cut something too? Yes. Okay, good. Is David allowed to have scissors? Uh, we'll see. It's we've a got, new year, Mark. We've got both scissors <laughs> yes. and, a, and a lighter, so we'll see what yeah. happens. Scissors so, and fire. I don't know that this is a necessary step, but it may help. So you're going to put a little bit of water around the, okay, the cool. opening cool. of your bottle here. Okay, a little water. A little water. And then, okay, so something I learned doing this last night, I initially wasn't putting enough paper in there and so it wasn't working so you want to get a decent amount of paper and this is just regular computer printer paper so you'll get that here i'm gonna get my i'm gonna get my egg so yeah so see how it doesn't fit egg. we're gonna make magic happen right. magic let's go <laughs> okay so right here as we as as it stands here we've got equal amount of pressure pushing down on the egg and then equal amount of pressure from inside the bottle pushing up. So Got it's it. it's staying tight. All right. Okay. So are you ready, I'm ready. to light? Okay. I'm so when egg. you do this, you're going to light the paper, you're going to drop it in and then quickly put the egg over top of it. I want I want to make sure everyone can see this, David. Okay. All right. <laughs> As David holds the grill lighter like a weapon. Oh, good job. <laughs> the paper go. didn't stay lit. The paper went out because there's no oh. oxygen in there. Oh, oh. but it should. Oh. Well, let's see. Dang it! Burn more fire. Longer. More fire. More fire. Let it burn more. just a well, little bit more. Fire. This is why I brought multiple. Okay, let's try Multiple bottles. Ooh. Okay. okay. Oh, so yeah. now we just got an egg that's smoked. <laughs> smoked egg. We got a smoky. Egg. <laughs> I will enough. say, last night doing this, I did have like I had to do a couple of. Oh, jeez. Oh, use, use the lighter. Use the lighter. There you go. Okay. Is it going to work? What happens if I, we set off the fire alarm? I don't think we'll set off the fire alarm. I'm worried. See, this is why I brought multiple of these. So I had to do it several times last night at home before I got it to work. Okay. All right, David's on that's, the right track here. He's, he's got more flame going. Yeah. Would it help if you turn the paper upside down and got more flame going I don't down? Know that Try way. putting it down. Okay. Apparently not. All right. <laughs> we'll work this out as a team. Yeah, I need I need to know because Rooney's going to be asking about this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it is super cool. I did it. Like I said, I did it at home last it night. There you go. There, there you go, go. Katie. There you Katie. Go. Katie. There you there go. Goes. <laughs> we are smoking. Hey! We got it. Anyway, so what you're doing here. The flame inside increases the pressure, and then as soon as it runs out of oxygen, uh, the pressure decreases. So then the pressure on top of the egg pushing down on it is greater than the pressure inside the bottle, and that's what makes the egg go down in there. Little trial and error for you. Have fun with this at home. It is super cool. But that, that's the way experiments are, trial yes. and error, right? Yes. Yeah. It smells kind of weird in it here. Smells like, <laughs> <laughs> like campfire. <laughs> it smells great. And, and You're fine. Hard-boiled eggs. Yes. <laughs> 
<laughs> Katie, and, David, thank you guys. Yeah. Mission, yeah. mission accomplished. Yeah, look at that. This It did take some trial and error, but it does work. And again, yeah, very the cool. key is finding the right size bottle. Mm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. Thank you. You're welcome. Happy New Year, guys. Happy New Year. <laughs>